hear that? That sound could potentially cure cancer. What you just heard is a new therapy called histotripsy, which has now been approved by the FDA to treat liver cancer. So how exactly does a sound do that? Histotripsy uses ultrasound technology, yes, like what a doctor would use to detect pregnancy, to make high energy sound waves that create micro bubbles in a tumor. The pressure created by the bubbles causes the cell to break down, killing the tumor. Dr. Chen Chi, a professor of biomedical engineering, radiology, and neurosurgery at the University of Michigan, where this therapy was developed, described the procedure almost like a nanobomb. When you expand, you squeeze the cell. When you collapse, you pull cells apart. And that allows us to really just mechanically break down the cells. Dr. Chi has been part of the histotripsy team for over 20 years. When she first started looking into ultrasound technology as a treatment, most people in the scientific community thought it would be a dead end. If the entire field is making an effort to tell you it's impossible, then it means that we're at the verge of a breakthrough that can potentially change the field. While histotripsy has only officially been approved for the treatment of liver cancers, there is hope that the technique can be adapted to cure others, such as pancreatic and renal cancers, and even cardiovascular and brain diseases. On top of that, she and her team have found that histotripsy can also stimulate the immune system, meaning that if cancer returns, the system has a better chance of attacking it in its early stages. Because histotripsy is entirely non-invasive, recovery time is also short and doesn't come with the side effects you see with chemo or radiation. So to sum up, a non-invasive sound-based treatment can potentially cure cancer and in the future might be able to cure other diseases as well, all without extreme side effects. It almost sounds too good to be true, but as she says, make the impossible possible. Isn't that why we do science?